Tade Pogacar is on a winning rampage and he's taking that form to the 2023 Perry Nice and he's decided to skip Strade Bianche to be ready for the appointment. His first face to face of the season with Jonas Vingago and ahead the Tour de France. Pogacar, already a winner of the Tour de France in 2020 and 2021, succumbed to Vingago in last year's edition. Vingago, with the help of his Jumbo Visma team, put pressure on superstar Pogacar, specifically in the 11th stage with teammate Primoz Rolich going full throttle. Vingago gained 2 minutes and 51 seconds and the race leader's yellow jersey. The Perigny stage race starts Sunday, March 5th, only one day after Strade Bianche in Italy. The timing is impossible for Pogacar, the 2022 winner of Strade Bianche. If I really want to be good in Perigny's, which I've never done before and is a super hard race, the team time trial will be very important, the Slovenian told Belgian outlet Sportza. We'll need to spend a few days together before the race. If I do Strade Bianche, it's impossible. He continued, I'd go to the team time trial without any knowledge of the group and I don't think it'll work. Pogacar stormed into the season, winning his first three races and the overall the Vuelta a Andalusia. With this focus on Perry Nice and Dane Jonas Vingago, it's clear his aim is to take back the Tour de France crown for 2023. From now, it'll only be hard, important races, Pogacar added in the interview. I'll try to be good in the classics, specifically Milano San Remo and Flanders, and then all eyes are on the Tour de France.